I want to thank you, Chairwoman Stefanik, and thank you. Um, um, you've got a new title, but the, the best title you got is Mama. For sure. Being an unrepentant mama's boy, I can tell you, that means a lot to me. But I come from the great state of Tennessee, and it's been hit the hardest. My state's formula sold out rate is about 50% right now. That's why I'm calling on the Tennessee Attorney General and the U.S. Attorney General to vigorously investigate any potential instances for illegal price gouging and stockpiling. Imagine somebody gouging the price of, of baby formula. To me, that, that classifies them in the dirt bag category, and they are. Even with these formula shortages for American babies, there are reportedly, as I stated earlier, pallets of baby formula may possibly being distributed at the border. Now, these poor immigrant babies are here of no fault of their own. But if it wasn't for President Biden's continued failure at the southern border, we would not even be discussing this issue right now. This feels like more like putting America last rather than America first. With the economic might of our government, we should be able to free up enough formula to, for our American babies. Just this weekend, we celebrated Mother's Day. And this week, it seems that all these mothers are doing now is worrying about feeding their babies. In the United States of America, folks, that is unacceptable. And thank you, Chair Lady, so much.